keep working on the transformation and modernization of Los Garzones Airport in Monteria. Los Garzones Airport is located 10 kilometers away from downtown Monteria City, the capital of Córdoba Department. Los Garzones operates flights to the main cities in the north region of the country, such as Cartagena in Barranquilla, as well as cities like Bogotá, Medellín and Rio Negro in Antioquia. Currently, this airport covers five national destinations, which include 21 commercial flights on weekdays and 23 of them on Thursdays and Saturdays. It also makes 19,300 annual operations. Since 2008, this airport has had a big renovation of services and infrastructure. This change has significantly increased the amount of travelers thanks to the investment made by Airplan, the licensed company of this one and other five airports located in the north-central region of the country. Before getting the license, this airport used to transport around 349,000 travelers and currently it moves about 906,000 of them. From 2008 until today, Airplan has invested more than 75,000 million pesos, which has also allowed the execution of important works such as the extension of the runway from 1,910 meters to 2,300 meters long and from 35 to 45 meters wide. The 844 square meters extension of the terminal building from 3,334 square meters to 4,178 square meters length. The extension of the platform from 18,810 square meters to 28,875 square meters length. Remodeling of the fire station. Construction of a new cargo terminal with an 830 square meters length. Improving of the airport health service facilities and equipment. Vehicle provisioning for ramp inspection. Supply of equipment for firefighting service. Baggage and security. New system for baggage handling, including a CTX. Instrumental Landing System Category 1 These improvements and the market needs have made the airport require new works, which have been authorized by the Colombian government with an additional investment that goes over 56,000 million pesos. New works for everyone. Extension of Travelers Terminal Building. The Airport Travelers Terminal Building has been extended from 4,178 square meters to 9,137 square meters in all its areas, keeping to standards for level C service established by the International Air Transport Association. This work includes a 4,959 square meters extension of the terminal, a new boarding room, the current one is 615 square meters length, it will be extended by 313 square meters to get a total area of 928 square meters. The construction of a new arrivals hall with an extra baggage claim band, it would also be extended by an extra 140 square meters for a total area of 370 square meters. Increasing in the amount of check-in counters. Currently, this airport has 17 check-in counters. There will be constructed 5 more for a total of 22 of them. Extension of the airport food court setting of electric stairs, fitting out of the taxi service zone, 
Extension of the energy availability. Departures Hall will be extended in 460 square meters, having as a result a bigger and more comfortable area of 822 square meters. The arrivals hall, which currently has an area of 81 square meters, will be extended in 278 square meters for a total area of 359 square meters. There will be an extra security control system for a total of two of them, warranting more agility and comfort. New approach lighting system. With the intention of improving and warranting the aircraft's landing conditions in case of low visibility or during night operations, and keeping to the specifications established by the national regulations and International Civil Aviation Organization, a new approach lighting system category 1 has been carried out in the airport. Runway resealing in order to improve operation conditions, 2,300 meters of the runway were resealed and its surface was improved with the aim of bringing a softer taking off and landing. Our job also includes the environment. That's why all of our works have environmental permits, such as forestry and environmental management plans, which have been issued by the competent authorities. These works make part of a big challenge that will help us improving the connection and having a better airport, but this will only be possible by having the support of those who make part of our day-to-day -day work at the airport Los Garzones. An airport like Córdoba and its thriving people deserve it.